Today's home workout with your qualified online trainer, Lucy Windermaid, is a total body workout you can do at home. You don't need any equipment, all the moves are standing. You are gonna love it. I'm gonna give you one of the best workouts. So, how it's gonna work? We simply have five moves. Each move we do for a repetition of just 10 reps. Then we repeat the routine a second time. So it goes through really quickly. You have an option to repeat it again. But I'll explain as we go along. So if you haven't already done a warm up, hit pause, march in the spot for say 20 seconds. And when you're ready, I'm ready to start training you today. So the first move we're gonna start with is a basic squat. If you don't like doing squats, I'm gonna show you an alternative move. So have your feet hip width distance apart. Let's just take that to that basic squat and then slowly coming up. So we're just doing 10 repetitions. So you can see the strike there going through each of those reps as we go through them. Make sure when you're doing the squat that you keep your toes slightly lifted so your knees are staying behind the line of your toes. All right, that's good. And this is where squats are so good for helping to build lower body strength and tone. And obviously these are all body weight exercises. That's good, so just keep that going. So we're doing 10 really slow and controlled squats. And we've got two more to go and let's take that down, keep those toes slightly lifted and let's just go for one more. And then coming back up standing. So this time now, what we're going to do, again, feet hip width distance apart and arms in front. And I just want you to step back, hold, and then step back up. And so we're just going to do this for, again, 10 repetitions. So if you don't like doing a backward lunge, you can just do that knee lift where you're just coming up. All right, that's good. And keep it really controlled. So here we're working through the upper body as well. And really draw your arms all the way back as you lunge that foot back. And by doing backward lunges, it's much safer on your knees. That's why I always do these. And again, it's a really powerful lower body workout. All right, so for the third move, this time now, we're going to do what I call a standing ab pike. So just take your fingertips to reach your toes, straight legs, just doing it for 10 repetitions. And this one here is really engaging through your core, plus we're working the legs and working through the arms, two and one. Now from there, I want you to step the feet wide and just have the knees slightly bent, tummy pulled in tight, arms crossed, and just reach from one side to the other. So the second time we do this routine, you will be familiar with the moves. So I just wanted to create a really quick, easy little full body toning body weight workout that you can do. Three and let's go two and one. Now stay in this position for me. If you can, lift your heels up. If you find it too hard, keep the heels on the floor and just pulse it. Go as low as you can for 10 counts for me. That's good. If you find that too hard with balance, keep those heels down on the ground. So that is 50 reps done. So we're gonna repeat that all again. Now to make that 100 reps. So let's start off with your squats, come into position, feet hip width distance apart, and let's squat that down. Remember, you've got your alternative move there. So keep it really slow and controlled. So you'll be familiar with these moves. So what I want you to do is really have full focus. Think about what you're doing. Think about how you are making your body stronger. And on here, what we're doing is we're developing lower body strength. And the great thing is we're doing body weight exercises and body weight is such an effective way to strengthen through your muscles without putting any pressure through your joints. It's a really effective way of training and toning your body. So nice control, keep it really slow. And that's two, well done. And we've got last one coming up. And let's just go one more, take that down and then coming back. So we're gonna get ready to go for that backward lunge, feet a little bit wider apart arms directly in front and let's step that back and pull those arms back. Remember you've got that alternative move if you don't like doing the backward lunge. So do this with really good technique, keep that upper body nice and straight, nice power as you step that back. So what we're doing here as well, these body weight exercises are really good. This kind of low impact is really good for your bone health as well as your joint health. All right, that's it and step that back and it's gonna really sculpt your body without building up bulk, but give you lovely tone and then take that back. 
All right, so we'll get ready for that next move. We're doing the abdominals, arms up, and give me that straight leg kick. So with this one, really keep those tummy muscles put in nice and tight. This exercise, I say always, it's way more effective than the plank. Really good to work through those abdominals, and we're also getting the benefit of working through the legs and the arms at the same time. So step your feet wide for me now, knees slightly bent, tummy muscles pulled in. Let's work in shaping your waist. Go for doing 10 from one side to the other. Nice control and each time if you can, take that arm a little bit further out to the side, down to the side. So we're really shaping and sculpting through your waist, working into those internal and external obliques. And then let's just go for that last move. So let's get ready and take those heels up and just pulse that for me for 10. If you find it too hard, heels up, keep them on the floor. Just go as low as you can. You are doing really well. Three, let's go two and one. So you have now completed 100 reps. If you want to do another 100, simply press rewind or stay here to finish the end of the video. But the beauty of this workout is you can do as many reps as you want. 100, 200, 300, 400, it's up to you. So if you liked today's video, please give it a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments, would you like more of these and this kind of format because then I can think of different moves to give you. And really well done with today's training. Oh, and there is your high five. Stay safe and I'll see you back on my YouTube channel tomorrow.